Hey you, yes you, the one that has landed on my page. Yes, I'm the one talking to you right now. Thanks for landing on my page, guys. My name is Zazby. I'm all about creating mental health and awareness, sharing my life stories and what have you, as well as tips and advice along the way, along with messages of hope and what have you. This one is all about, basically, I feel mm. close to my heart to share with you of another dear letter or open letter series that I have clearly addressed in my diary encounters if you've been following me on this channel. This one's all about for someone who may feel worthless. So if you feel this is for you, st stand by and actually listen in. If you don't feel this is for you of what I'm about to share that is close to my heart, pass it on to someone that you feel is right for them because at the end of the day, I believe that we need to be able to build each other up and not tear each other down regardless of our everyday life. Okay, as I said, yes, I'm talking to you right now as I sit down writing this or shall I say speaking this out to you right now in a form of a hope and a wish for you all that's basically who feel worthless that you can only at this moment of time giving countless numbers on your fingers of the amount of people who has hurt you, betrayed you, lost your trust along the way with these people based on the betrayal and feeling of nothing but emptiness and void of on the one hand even though it may be countless of times that is too many to count on your hand but that is not always the case as I know that there will be bound to be a lot of people in your life that has hurt you in many ways and forms regardless what it is they may have lied to you cheated they backstabbed you they laughed behind your back they have basically just wanted it to just prove their that were wrong, they're right, they're being the high top dog hearsay. Again, I wish I could, you could know how many people that have betrayed you and left you behind or even left you feeling empty, either in the past or even in the present right now. But right now I say and I declare, it doesn't really even matter if you can feel your own two hands with the names of the people who has done this. Why should we name names and point the finger and actually do the same to them? We are better than them. As well as in the saying this though, however, there are many other thoughtless acts and words that they may have said to us or done to us or even just a few fingers of the up yours, excuse me for doing so. Because the weight and the pain of this hurt can last for a very long time. But again, it's up to us, our choice of the matter. If we want it to last a long time or want it to be gone. Or even making that sta stand and decision right now, enough is enough. For ourselves. I am more to what these people may have said and done to me. I am more than these actions that they have done to me. Nothing or no one should stand in the way. Nothing or no one can affect me or my future if I choose them, them to do so, to let them in, invite them in to, for their own entertainment's sake. After so many tired and tested attempts at trying to give your best to others, they s somehow always walk all over you like a carpet or make you feel as if you're, shall I say, a doormat or some other form of item. Now, it's time to stop letting others to determine your worth, your self-value. Now is the time to stop letting others walk all over you. Now is the time to not ask for validation of your feelings and emotions around them. Now is the time to stop giving others the power to control our mind, thoughts, actions and our emotions. Now is the time to let go. Letting go of what doesn't belong in your life anymore. Easy said I am done, but it can be done. Believe you me. Now is the time to stand up for yourself, to defend everything in your power and your glory. And to claim back everything that did and was belonging to you. And what you deserve in life. You deserve to be happy. You deserve to be loved. You deserve to be feel wanted. You deserve to be appreciated. You are more... You are worth more than gold. You are more worth than diamonds, however. You are more worth than any pr precious stones that we ever wear as a form of a jewelry piece. Your beauty shines brighter than all the stars 
in the bright night sky. Your heart is deeper than the deepest ocean, far within the corners of your mind. You know all of this is so true. You just need to accept it and live it and breathe it. I am here to tell you today, from based on my life experiences, this is true. That the people around you who may make you feel worthless aren't worth a millisecond of our time, our effort, our energy and the like. Or also our thoughts, no more, kaput, let them go. You know what is best for yourself and sacrificing your happiness for the sake of someone else isn't what's best for you. Do what you feel is best for you. Regardless, this is your story, this is your journey. You can do anything if you choose to. As much of a selfless person you are, you can no longer ignore the red flags that has been flagging up nine times in a ten when they show up in a given relationship that you're in, boyfriend or girlfriend, friendship or a family member. <laughs> you are so incredibly worthy of giving and receiving the best love possible. Do not settle for less, however. You don't deserve less. After everything you have gone through, the mornings it was so hard to get out of the bed, and the nights you were so paralyzed with self-doubt, fear, anxiety, and the like of all these emotion, negative emotions, you deserve to focus on yourself right now. You are more important than anyone else. You deserve to take that time out for yourself, regardless what it is. You and I both know how easy it is to get sucked right into the deep dark hole that is filled with self-doubt and self-loathing. But having to climb out of that hole myself, however, took a long haul and a long realisation of where I had to head for. I can confidently say that falling into it is no longer daunting. I know my way out and you will too by finding the right support network, finding the ones that does care about you and finding friends and family for support in your time of need. Realising your worth will not be a quick and easy process, however, believe you me, from my experience, it does take a while for the self-healing to begin. But it is rather a very crucial journey for yourself to discover, explore. It took me years of being hurt and treated the way I was poorly to truly understand that all of those people who treated me poorly simply didn't see my worth. But here I am today as a living testimony and proof that I am worth and what their words, action, thoughts, and that about me, against me, is all about. I am worthy, and I always have been, and so have you. What most of us fail to realise is that even though people may treat us not right, we shouldn't blame ourselves for their own actions. They treated you poorly because they simply don't know how to properly treat someone as amazing as you or myself. You aren't at fault for the shitty ways of that someone who treated you that badly. We all feel worthless at times, but this is a letter, is a gentle reminder to you all that you're not alone. I'm here for you. I can support you. I can uplift you if you choose to invite me in to your world, into your life. I'm not here to judge. I'm not here to criticize. I'm just here for the long haul. This is a letter to remind you that you are so worthy of giving and receiving the best love. You can rise above from the darkness and everything up above that too, which is in your self-doubt, your self-conscious of your worth. Your body will shine through even the darkest nights. You deserve the absolutely best. So don't forever settle, forever live your dream and fulfill what you need to do in your life. This is your life story. Create what is worth. There's more than just one page or one chapter per day. Live it, be it, breathe it, and be the best you can be. Well, this ends basically an open letter to someone who may feel worthless. Give me a like, full thumbs up, or support, comment below. Message me if you need be, if you need someone to talk to, either through my social media site of SB Unsaw, or even just private message me here on YouTube. If you haven't subscribed and you would like to be part of my YouTube family or just want to be part of my journey, Feel free to subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell if you haven't done so already so you can keep up to date with new things that's coming your way regardless what it may be, be it inspirational messages, be it, you know, my other everyday health and awareness topics and maybe some fun stuff along the way. 
who knows what this will hold for the rest of the year. Feel free to follow me on my social media sites listed in the description below. Feel free to also, you know, leave a comment, you know, hey Aspie or what have you, just to show that you're engaging with me. Feel free to also share these videos around to family and friends because, as I said, this needs to be shared amongst our family and friends or whoever they may be struggling regardless. So no further ado, guys. Thanks for your support. Do what you love, love what you do. Until next time, Aspie signing out and I'll see you again soon.